All new at six, a new state report is now confirming what many have believed for a long time. Cancer rates are higher in a section of Buffalo's east side and Cheektowaga. These areas include the 414211, 14215, and 14225 zip codes and is called the East Buffalo West Cheektowaga area. The study looked at rates based in data from 2011 to 2015. Here's what the study found. Rates of esophageal cancer in these three zip codes was 71% higher than expected. Lung cancer was 25% higher, colorectal rates were 40% higher, prostate 49% higher, and kidney cancer was 69% higher in the East Buffalo, West Cheektowaga area. So what is behind these higher numbers? The study found rates of smoking and obesity are higher in this area compared with other parts of the state, and fewer people have health care coverage. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Madison Carter explains why some say this is an issue that's going to take much more than a report to address. It's not a resource problem, Madison. It's a will problem. Pastor George Nicholas heads the African American Health Equity Task Force. He says the report out this week is putting the cart before the horse when it comes to solutions. So you can't change health outcomes without changing economic outcomes. And you can't really change your economic outcomes without changing educational outcomes. And you can't change, you know. We've always been that community that could be ignored. We've always been that community that has never been listened to. And we've always been that community where no one really seems to care what happens to us or our children. Reverend Diane Holt says it's going to come down to leaders being convinced to prioritize resources in the black community. We've got to do better across the board. And the scary piece is that it costs money. Nicholas says it's going to take not just money, but policies, development, infrastructures, and bodies, human resources. There has been structural, institutional, systemic racism that has been embedded in our culture since we came here. The report says it's not the environment that's causing the higher rates of cancer. It's lifestyle, smoking, and obesity rates are higher in the cluster area. To Nicholas, that's just where the conversation about a solution needs to start. People focus on kind of outcomes and not deal with the roots. Now, health officials are holding a public meeting at the Buffalo Museum of Science next Tuesday to talk about some of these issues with the public. But those leaders we spoke with today said it can't just be them at the table. It has to be developers, transportation officials, and job creators to really get to the root of the issue. In the newsroom tonight, Madison Carter, 7 Eyewitness News.